everyone, welcome back on board. Uh, we are a little over a week into the tour now, and uh, so we've had a lot of stops, a lot of successful stops, and there are three things that basically we hear uh, whenever we stop somewhere. One is people wanting to share their personal stories on why healthcare reform is important for them. For example, we heard about the dad from uh, Bismarck, North Dakota, whose son is a hemophiliac, and his dad worries about how he's going to be able to get health insurance in the future because of his pre-existing condition. Uh, second, we've heard about uh, people um, and their overwhelming support uh, for the President's health care reform package, including the choice of a public health insurance plan option to compete with private insurance companies to lower costs and guarantee quality coverage for all. And third, what we've heard is a need for the facts. People want to know what's in health insurance reform for them. And so there's a few websites that you can check out right now to get the facts. Uh, the first is uh, from Healthcare for America Now. Uh, the leading coalition in the country for health care reform. Their web address is healthcareforamericanow.org. The second is a website that's been set up by the Department of Health and Human Services uh, to get all the facts about the President's reform package, what it means for, for folks like you in your state, and that uh, address is healthreform.gov. Again, healthreform.gov. Uh, for some more policy information on, uh, on the specific proposals that are out there, if you want to learn about the House bill and what it means for your state and your city, check out the Energy and Commerce uh, Committee's website. That website address is energycommerce.house.gov. Uh, check that out. And for some more policy information and the facts about health care reform, you can check out the Economic Policy Institute's website, that's epi.org, or Center for American Progress, and that is americanprogress.org. And finally, I mentioned this one the other day, but to end the smears and lies about what health care reform would mean for retirees and seniors, check out the Alliance for Retired Americans website at retiredamericans.org. Thanks, and we'll be back soon.